ready to order some seeds for spring. So I just went through all of my seeds in here. And yes, I followed along the trend. Lots of people are putting seeds in these. I think they're meant for like photographs. Get these at Michael's or Amazon. But I follow the trend and that's how I'm storing my seeds for now anyways. It is nice to organize them this way. What I did, I just went through all of my seeds and I wrote down in, this is my planner, in the back of my planner there was some um, blank pages. So I just wrote down all of the flowers I have and some vegetables I need. I kind of know what I have for vegetables and I'm looking for a few specific ones. Uh, for flowers, there's no way I would keep track. I would definitely order some that, that I already have. So to prevent me from doing that and spending money that I don't need to spend, I did write them all down. I didn't write down the sunflowers because I have those memorized and I'm not really looking to purchase any more sunflowers this year. But the rest of the flowers, I need to have a little cheat sheet here in terms of what I already have. So that's what I did. I'll show you a few. I'm most excited. One of my favorite things to plant are zinnias. These are all my zinnias. Most of them are from Johnny Seeds. I love, I love their flowers there. And I like that they have a reusable flap. Um, I wish they had pictures of the flowers because they're so pretty. And on the website, the pictures of the flowers just catch your attention and you feel like you need to buy everything. Some ones I have, Zinderella Peach. Oklahoma Salmon, Oklahoma Carmen, Queen Lime Orange Zinnia, oh that was my favorite last year by far, Oklahoma Pink, that's pretty, Oklahoma Golden Yellow, Giant Dahlia Flowered Mix, Signora Zinnia, Cactus Flower Mix, Oklahoma Formula Mixed Improved. I just, I love, I love shopping for flower seeds, it's so much fun. I did buy, I don't know, I have like this lettuce, I have lettuce seeds and I really don't know what to do about lettuce because I've grown them for two years and they look absolutely gorgeous, but they taste so bitter and I don't, I'm assuming it's from a lack of water, I'm assuming you just have to water them constantly and I just do not have the time to do that with my job and everything so i don't know if i'm gonna plant lettuce this year i have quite a few like melon where are they i have some like random melons which always make me so excited to plant but here in saskatchewan they don't grow well like this one is melon golden jenny so Last year I did grow a few and on one plant I got maybe one little mini cantaloupe. So I don't know if I could start them earlier, if I just need to water them more, take better care of them. I don't know but they were really super juicy and tasty and it was so fun to plant something different and unique but they don't do well so I'm not sure if I should be dedicating the space to these. Like, look at this, this is cool. Melon Kiku Chrysanthemum from Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds. And I love how they have this beautiful picture of what it is on there. And yeah, I'm just, that's about it. I, I'm curious, what is everyone planning on buying this year for seeds? Are you gonna try anything new out? Are you planting flowers or vegetables? Let me know in the comments below and stay tuned if you want to watch me. This will be my third year, which is crazy because I still feel clueless and I feel so young, but I'm actually 30 this year. So that's weird. Very weird. I still feel like I'm in my early 20s and just going about life clueless. So yeah, talk to you later.